My name is Jimmy Staples, I'm the Project Advisor on the Enable Conservation Tillage Project here with Chagas. In this series of videos, I'm going to demonstrate how to accurately identify a number of different grass weeds. So in this first video, we're going to run through the different characteristics that you need to be aware of in order to make an accurate identification. So first, you'll need some tools to help you. You'll need a weed guide. In this video, I'm going to be using the buyer weed guide. You'll need a small pen knife or knife for dissecting the plant. You'll also need a little hand lens, which will be used to look at some of the more subtle characteristics. And then you'll also need a spade or a trowel for digging up the plant's roots and all. So you've spotted a grass weed in your, in your farm or in one of your fields and you're not sure what it is. So the first thing you need to do in order to actually identify that is to dig it up. So get in and get in and get, get underneath it and get the roots and everything. So you dig it up, clean it off, get the soil off it so you can see exactly what's going on at the root and see, so would you have the likes of a stole on or a rhizome or is there a colouring on it? This is a scutch plant here and you can see it has a, an underground stem which is called a rhizome, which is where you'll have your new shoots growing off. The next thing you're probably going to look at then, you'll look at whether the, the leaves are folded or rolled within the actual stem. So you know, you'll know by basically rolling it between your fingers and you can feel it whether it's flat or whether it's rolled. You'll look at the leaves and see if there's certain characteristics on the leaf that would be a good identifier. So there might, be, there might be a twist in the leaf, there might be hairs on the leaf. The best way of doing this is to actually take the leaf, flattened, and roll it over your thumb and then look down across it and you will see if there's, the hairs are present or not. You know, the colouring, if it's, if it's a broad or narrow leaf. You also then you look at, at the auricles. The auricles are the little arms or collar that wraps around the stem at the base of the leaf. As you can see here, barley has quite a pronounced auricle. Wheat will have a more subtle auricle with tiny hairs on it. And their auricles are absent in your cultivated oats. You'll also look at maybe the ligule. The ligule you'll find you'll find here, um, which is a little um, transparent membrane that sticks up between, again, at the base of the leaf and the stem. And then finally, what you would do is you would look at the seed head, which at this time of the year, coming up the, into the summer, will be a, a, a really good identifier of, of what the grass that you have that you're looking at. Thanks for watching. If you require any other information, please see the grassroots section on our website, chagas.ie.